this river. But we do have storms and they're hitting Lecompton or edging into Lecompton as we speak right now. Let's take a look at those current conditions though in Topeka. What's building these storms? The heat right now, the current temperature 94 degrees in Topeka. That makes a heat index of 101 degrees when you have factor in that humidity. Titan Doppler 49 is going to show those storms that are manifesting because of this heat outside right now. Looks like those gusty winds are probably hitting Topeka as well. The actual storms further to the north. We're just getting the leading edge of these thunderstorms in the form of wind right here in Lecompton along I-70. We have had some severe thunderstorm warnings with these storms. Let's see if we have any warnings out there right now. Luckily, the severe thunderstorm warnings actually from some other thunderstorms that I can see here. They're to the south and east of the 49 viewing area. But the storms that are moving in from the north and from the northwest have had a hit street of producing 60 to 70 mile per hour winds all banking on this heat we do have that heat excessive heat warning in effect through thursday we could see a tiny reprieve from that heat overnight but building back up again on your thursday with those temperatures right now across the area very very hot in the upper 90s to near 100 degrees where those storms have not hit yet but notice those temperatures to the northeast up towards hiawatha and seneca and st joseph in the 70s and those areas probably seeing a lower heat index as well those storms have cooled things off temporarily, but notice where the storms haven't hit yet. 101 still in Topeka, 101 in Emporia. That's what it feels like to your body. So it's very dangerously hot still until these storms and those gusty winds hit your area. Let's take a look and see what our Truby weather model here is forecasting with those thunderstorms. I think it's doing a fantastic job. Just look at that. Lining up right now along I-70, but carrying on through about 10 o'clock. And then we should start to see a decrease in some thunderstorms, but I still expect isolated storms throughout the nighttime. Still cannot rule an isolated chance as we carry on into your Thursday, but hazy, hot, and humid, that will certainly be around on your Thursday. Forecast for tonight is severe thunderstorm watch is in effect until 11 p.m. for areas along Highway 75 on east for these thunderstorms that are nearing Lecompton as we speak right now. As we carry on into your Thursday, whoo, look at those temperatures, 99 again. Heat index value could be pushing 105 degrees and the seven day forecast, good news here. I wanted to mention that the searing heat shows an end. Ah, it does, look at that. By the time we get into Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, look at those temperatures dropping down into refreshing 80 degree weather. We'll definitely take those. So let's take another look here. And if I could have my cameraman, Greg, point at uh, the turbulent clouds that we have coming in right now here into Lecompton. This is the leading edge of the thunderstorms. Again, these are just gusty winds. We do not have any lightning right now, but we are expecting along I-70, gusty winds up to 30 to 40 miles per hour out ahead of the main storms, which will continue to line up and move through the air. We'll keep you updated with regards to the severe weather. Marshanna, probably not the best time to be on the lake right now, but not such a bad weekend upcoming for it though, by the looks of it.